Reduce the paint according to the instructions on the paint container. HVLP tends to dry the paint faster than traditional air spray, so if you're using retarder, use one step more than you would normally use. Push the lever to release the cup from the claw. Filter the paint when loading the cup. Engage the claw and push the lever to tighten. Connect the quick release hose coupling to the turbine and the gun. Generally the fluid control will be set at or near maximum and the pattern adjuster will be set at full fan width. Adjust the fan width by turning the pattern adjuster. Test the spray pattern on a piece of scrap material. Increase the airflow by turning the speed control knob just until you achieve good atomization. It's counterproductive to raise it any higher than necessary. To clean, first remove the cup and dump out the unused paint. Allow the siphon tube to drain fully. Tip the gun upside down and trigger the gun to allow any residual paint to drain out of the tip. And wipe off the outside of the gun with thinner. Put a small amount of thinner in the cup and run it through the gun. Remove the air cap, nozzle, and needle. Clean thoroughly with a brush and thinner. Use wooden toothpicks to carefully clean the orifices. Now reassemble the gun. Check the turbine's air filters periodically and clean if necessary. To clean, remove the four Phillips head screws and lift away the filter vent. Remove the outer filter, then press the clip to remove the pleated main filter with its frame. Blow clean with compressed air and reassemble.